In this tutorial, we will guide you on how to find out your internet service provider. For the Windows operating system, you'll need two things, the IP address and the who is utility for the command prompt. Since Windows doesn't have a who is utility by default, we will have to download it ourselves. So first, let's get started with figuring out what our IP address is. There are two ways you can do this. One is locally, and the other is through the internet. For determining the IP address locally, you'll need to open up the command prompt. So let's press the Windows R key to open up the run command and type CMD there. Once the command prompt is open, type IP config and hit enter. Now we will locate the default gateway for the internet device we're currently using. This will be used to access the machine and determine our IP address. So let's type the default gateway in the address bar here in Firefox. And there you go, the internet device's user interface is opened up, and over here you can see what the current IP address is assigned to you. The other way is that you can log on to whatismyipaddress.com, and in the front page only, you'll be shown the IP address assigned to you. Now that we've determined the IP address, we need the whois utility to determine who our internet service provider is. For that, you'll need to visit technet.microsoft.com and search for whois version 1.11. Simply download the utility and extract the contents of the zip folder. Here you'll be provided with one executable file. In order to be able to run the whois command via the command prompt, you need to copy and paste this file in the Windows directory. So let's copy this file by pressing Ctrl C. With that done, press the Windows E key to open up my computer. From here, we will enter the C drive and open up the Windows directory. With that done, we will paste the file over here. Next, let's head back to the web browser and open up the router page. Next, let's open up the command prompt here. Now we will write the whois keyword here, followed by the IP address. This will bring up all the details regarding the IP address, including the internet service provider details. If we scroll up over here, you can see that everything from the ISP's name, address, location, and contact details is present here. In Mac, things are a bit simpler, since there is a built-in whois utility. You don't need to download any application for that. To know the default gateway in Mac, open up the Apple menu and click on the System Preferences option. From here, move to the Internet and Wireless section and click on the Network option. Over here, you can select the Ethernet tab if you're connected through the LAN. If you're connected through the Wi-Fi, it will be appearing over here as well. So click on the option you're currently connected with. For this tutorial, we will select the Ethernet tab and the default gateway will be given next to Router over here. Now you can open up the browser and access the Internet device. Once you have tamed the IP address in Mac, simply open up the terminal application. With that done, write the whois keyword followed by the IP address. And there you have it. All the details related to your internet service provider will be shown, including the name of the organization, etc. Thanks for watching. This was a howtech.tv tutorial.